Let's take a look at the Captain Wise voice fight in Black Myth Wukong and some tips and tricks on how you can take him down. Right from the beginning of the fight, try to get close to him and underneath of him. He shoots a lot of lasers and if you get caught by it, it can do quite a bit of damage. Now for this fight, the main thing that you want to focus on is his head. So staggers, stuns, anything that gets him to the ground you want to use. But while you can't reach his head, just focus on his ankles and sometimes he will lower his head on his own. You can get in, get some hits in, and then just use Immobilize to keep him there to get some additional hits in. When he gets back up, just focus your attacks on his ankles as before and try to get a stagger in. Many of his attacks will miss you if you're positioned directly underneath of him. If you see him charge up a light beam on the ground and stomp, this is a two part attack where it shoots out waves on the ground. And he may follow this up by shooting lightning blasts that come down from the sky. When you're dodging, just try to stay close to his legs and get as many hits as you can because eventually you may get a stun and when he lowers his head, you can cast a pluck of many if you have it or if you have a wandering white, you can do the headbutt for big damage. As you continue to build up damage and build up your hits, try to do as many heavy attacks as you can to build up that stagger meter and you might knock him down again. Once you get his health low enough, at some point he will go into a phase where he'll be invulnerable and he'll start shooting lasers all around his body. Position your character as close as you can to his legs to dodge the lasers. Now to follow up the laser beams, he'll shoot lightning blasts from the sky and they do small area damage. Do your best to run around outside of the circles and only dodge when you need to to avoid that damage. Now this may go on for quite a bit of time and it gets even worse. He'll start shooting more lasers around the map. And when you see the floor start to glow, it's about to explode. When he finishes this attack, he may follow this up with the floor stomp attack that he does twice. If you see his head start to glow, try your best to get underneath of him because he's about to do a large beam that shoots across the map. If you take a hit from this, this may end the fight or it may half your health. If you really need to, cast Cloud Step to get away from him. Be aggressive with this boss, stay on top of him, and take this boss down. Let me know down in the comments if you use any spells to help you out during this fight. I hope you enjoyed this one and learned something new, and I'll catch you in the next one.